Alright, we're gonna take a look at some numbers here. This is a chart with the many world religions. And on your right, you see the adherence and the percentages. Alright, number one would be Christianity with 2.2 billion adherents, that's 31% of the world's population of nearly 7 billion. Islam coming in at number second with 1.6 billion, that's 22% of the world's population. All right, and then you have your secular, non-religious, agnostic, atheist, Wow, they're pretty high up in the scale. I wasn't aware of that. 1.1 billion? Wow, that's a lot of heathens. 15% of the world's population. These would be a Satanist. Wow. A lot of scum in the earth, it seems. Bad enough, we got all these heathens and these uh, religions of Christianity and Islam, which both of these religions are no good. Alright, we got the people of the Creator trapped in Christianity, Islam, Hinduism, Chinese traditions, Buddhism, African religions, Sikhism, Spiritism, Judaism, Baha'i, Jainism, Shinto, Kaodai, I mean all these religions, Rastafarianism, whatever, Neo-Paganism. So, the people of the Creator could be found in a lot of these religions, but the predominant one where the people of the Creator are trapped is in Christianity, that cult of war. Islam is another cult of war. Christianity is a false religion, Islam too, and all these other ones. All right, which brings me to this verse here. Matthew 7.13, it says that the wide gate, the wide gate of destruction, that is the path that most people go into. That the straight gate, the straight gate of righteousness is very small and few find it. So I ask you, Christianity with 2.2 billion adherents to all you Christians watching this video are Christians on the narrow road or are they on the wide road to destruction if you go by the numbers 2.2 billion adherents I don't think that's a religion that is on the narrow road seems to me like they are on the broad road to destruction. And a lot of the people in Christianity, they're, they're going down the wrong path. So, yeah, the numbers don't lie. Come out of her, my people. Come out of Babylon. Babylon are all these religions. But like I said, Yashorel is mostly found in Christianity. Most of them are captive there spiritually. In Islam as well. But that's mostly the Ishmaelite religion of Ishmael. And his descendants, Christianity would be Esau's religion, the Edomites. And the secular, non-religious, agnostic, atheists, these are your Satanists. I mean, all these are scum for the most part, so... Yeah... Just food for thought. I mean, Christianity, the people who call themselves Christians, they are part of those that are on the broad road to destruction. With one third of the world's population, no doubt about it. So I just wanted to share that interesting stat with you. And that's all I got for this video. You know, till next time. Shalom.